Good evening, teacher. Good evening. How are you doing, Patty? Fine, teacher. Great. Good evening, teacher. Good evening, Marco. How are you doing tonight? I'm fine. And you? Great. I'm doing good, too. Thank you very much for asking. Yes, I'm doing good. Excellent. <laughs> OK. Well, we're going to start now, guys. Um, welcome, everyone, to your uh, class number 15. Remember that tonight we are ending unit three. So please, everyone has to submit a, the last homework of unit three. It will be homework number 15, okay? So please do it right after the class. And um, because uh, the report is taken by in support right from the system, so we don't want you to be checked, right? So please, please everyone do it. And uh, let me see, I'm going to start by taking the attendance. I see not much of you are connected. Okay. But I have to do it, okay? I have to do it. I'm sorry for that, but I have to do it. So Alba Janet Lopez Avalos. Present teacher. Thank you. Um, Cecia Gemima Perez Ideos. Present teacher. David Alejandro Choto Martinez. Present teacher. Okay. Um, Delmi Isabel Dera Salguero. Daisy Carolina Sánchez Nieto. Grecia Tatiana Rosales Campos. Grecia, are you there? I went by chat. No, I cannot see you. Okay. Juan Diego Lopez Palacios. Linda Alicia Valladares Arqueta. Luz Verónica Trujillo de Urbina. Present. Marco Adonai Villeda Alvarado. Present teacher. Mayra Yanira Alfaro Posada. Melida Isabel Bonilla Ventura. Néstor Ariel Garzón Asensio. Uh, Pablo Alberto Magaña Molina. Present teacher. Patricia Eugenia Navarro de Rosales. 
Present teacher. Roxana Marilyn Perez Ortiz. Present. Okay. I'm seeing that Linda is just connected, Present. right? Connecting. Okay. Uh, tell me, okay, tell me. Okay, I checked you in already. Okay, people, we are gonna start a class tonight with a short feedback. Remember that today is unit three review and practice. So you are going to be working and practicing all the contents in this unit. Remember that we have been studying the present continuous because we are expressing and describing ongoing activities, right? Ongoing activities in our workplaces. So let's uh, go over there and let's start. No sé por qué se mueve tanto este cuadro. Debería quedar quieto tal como lo dejo, pero algo pasa. Ok. Creo que lo que tengo que dejar fijo son las aplicaciones, ¿verdad? Al tamaño del cuadro. Ok. Let's go here. So to, tonight we are going to have a review and uh, some practice of unit three. And the goal for tonight is obviously using the present continuous describing activities. Okay, we are gonna talk about activities using present continuous. Remember affirmative, negative and questions we have learned about the direct questions and the WH questions. Okay, and the agenda for tonight is the ING verb form feedback. Then we're gonna have a little game online about the WH questions. Then we are gonna do a reading activity, reading activity. And after that, finally, we're gonna write an email describing activities and talking about temporary situations, okay, with the present continuous. Uh, tonight is not for Maida. I didn't change that, I forgot. Okay, and I'm going to check who is next. Okay, this is the video conference number 15. May I ask you a question, guys? What date is it today? What date is it today, Luz? Perdón, no teacher. Dije, what eh? date is it today? Today is October 20. Thank you very much. Today is October the 20th. Okay, remember to add the 20th. Okay, here we go. We are going to start with this exercise as a short feedback. So everyone please helping here. Everybody paying attention and we need your participation, okay? Let's remember how to write the ing, I'm, I'm sorry, the infinitive form of the verbs in this case for these ing verb forms, okay? So let's see. The first one, the first one, what verb is it? What verb is it? Help. Help. Okay. Excellent. Now the next one.
what verb is managing? What infinitive? What is the infinitive for managing? Mm -hmm. Are you there, guys? I can't see you. Please turn on your cameras. I cannot see anyone here. Okay. Okay. What is the next verb? Manage, teacher. Excellent. Okay. What is the next one? Hub. Okay. Mm -hmm. What's the next one? Super bad, right? Next one? Oh. oh. Okay. Next. Put. Okay. Next one? Prepare. Get. Get. Yet. Okay. Next one. Mm -hmm. Enjoy. Good. Send. Mm -hmm. Bye. Bye. Okay. Oh. Oh. Okay. Aquí la L no suena. Se dice talk. Talk. Okay. Next one. Make. Make. Mm -hmm. Next one. Do. Do. Correct. And the last one. Take. Good. Very good. So helping, help. Managing, manage. Having, have. Supervising, supervise. Calling, call. Putting, put. Preparing, prepare. Getting, get. Raining, rain. Enjoying, enjoy. Sending, send. Buying, buy. Talking, talk. Making, make. Doing, do. Taking, take. Okay, now let's see. Delmi, please, can you read the first column here? This one's helping. Teacher, sorry, what is manage? Managing is um, dirigir o gerenciar. De la dos formas, teacher. Yes, please. Uh, de las dos formas, ing and infinitive. Okay, helping, help. Managing, manage. Having, have. Supervising, supervise. Calling, call. Putting, put. Preparing, prepare. Getting, get. Excellent. Roxana, please, the next column. Writing, write. Enjoying, enjoy. Sending, send. Mm. Buying. Buying, yes. Buying. Buy. Okay. Talking, talk. Making, make. Doing, do. Taking, take. Ok, si este lo pronunciamos do, aquí sería doing, ok, con u, doing. Ok, aquí no decimos doing, decimos doing, doing, ok. I want to hear you, Roxana, doing. Doing. Excellent. 
So now we want to listen to Mayra, please. Mayra, please read this. Hola, buenas noches. Hello, explico, good evening. Me, me acabo de entrar. Yes. Okay. Diga. You just have to read, okay? Read the two forms of the verb. La primera forma es la ing, la segunda es la infinitivo, ¿verdad? La del, eh, este es el gerundio y este es el infinitivo. Entonces, va a leer las dos formas de cada verbo en esta columna, ¿ok? Ok. Sería eh, helping, helping. Helping. Helping, help. Excellent. Eh, money, money. Managing, manage. Managing, money, main. ¿Cómo las manage? Okay, ajá, uh -huh. repeat after me. Managing. Managing. Manage. Manage. Ajá. Uh -huh. Having. Have. Excellent. Supervising. Supervise. Correct. Calling. Call. Eh... Uh, Pulling, pulling, pudding. Pudding, put. Excellent. Preparing, prepare. Hearing, no, hating. Este es g, como la, como la de gato. Getting. Get. Getting. Get. Exactly. Getting, get. Thank you very much, Mayra. So now we want to listen to Luz, please, these other columns. Are you there, Luz? Okay, let's see. Who wants to participate, guys? Yes, teacher, I want to participate. Okay, please, Nestor, can you uh, say all these verbs in this column? The okay. ING verb form and the infinitive verb form. Okay. Raining, rain, enjoying, enjoy, sending, send, budging, buy, talking, talk, Making, may, doing, do, taking, take. Thank you very much, Nestor. So welcome. now we, okay, we are going to continue with this, okay? So is the contrary, okay? We have to write the ing verb form for each of these verbs, okay? So now, what you are going to do, please, everyone access to the board, okay? Access to the board and write the ING verb form for each verb. For example, uh, let's see. Uh, uh, entren todos ahorita a la pizarra. A ver. Intenten todos entrar. Para que escriban acá, ¿verdad? Agarren un verbo antes que se lo gane el otro para que usted escriba ese verbo, ¿ok? En la forma ING. Let's start. I can write it for my cell phone. Can you write? I think you can do it with your pen. Uh, you go to the... Okay. okay, okay, teacher. Okay. okay. Ah, no, no me sale la opción. Es un lapicito que está en un círculo.
<laughs> no, teacher. <laughs> I can try. Try. You were doing. Who? Linda. Linda. Um. I cannot give you my control, Linda. You may uh, access by the annotation, okay? By a, a la opción. Oh, okay, okay. Good idea, good idea. Linda, vaya a la, a la opción arriba donde aparece que yo estoy compartiendo la pantalla. Arriba usted mira que hay un lápiz en donde dice anotar. Ahí usted le da... Ok, y le pone dibujar con un lápiz o le pone, si está, si está desde el teléfono, linda, solamente sale un lapicito en la esquina de abajo izquierda. Sale un lápiz en un círculo. There you go. You're doing Estoy a good job. de la computadora, pero no lo encuentro. Vaya, dele para arriba, hasta arriba en su, en su, con el mouse, váyase hasta arriba y le va a aparecer el menú. El menú que está arriba donde dice está compartiendo pantalla. Ve que hay un, una verde y un rojo, ¿verdad? Una verde ahí arriba. Entonces, arriba de ese tiene que aparecerle un negro. ¿Ok? Una cinta negra de menú. ¿Ok? ¿Ya la yo? Sí, ver opciones, dice. Va, entonces póngale en ver opciones y póngale anotar. Mention. Creo que ya. Yeah. Okay, are you in? Okay, great. Managing. Good. Mm -hmm. Uh-huh. Raining. Remember the letter G at the end. Okay. Teacher. Mm -hmm. Try the, the G at the end, but uh, <laughs> couldn't you? It's, it's because of the space. <laughs> Oh, okay. Yeah, I know that is going to be. Okay, okay. Good. Ahora que ya practicaron y que ya pudieron entrar, lo vamos a hacer de manera ordenada para que ya agarremos todos, okay? Voy a dejar de, uh, voy a borrar todos los dibujos. Dejen de escribir ahí. Okay. <laughs> lo han hecho muy bien. Hicieron un excelente trabajo, okay? Veo que tienen, eh, han tenido en mente las reglas de spelling, ¿verdad? The spelling rules. Y eso es lo importante. Bien, voy a borrar todos estos. Pero ahora es como una carrera, ¿ok? Si alguien ya escribió ese verbo, ya no lo escriba usted, ¿ok? Vamos a ver. It's like a, yes, a competition. Okay. Get one. Mm -hmm. Okay, we can start to write. Yes. ¿Lo escribimos? Yes, please. Now. Yeah, but you need to write the ING verb form, okay? ING verb form. Mm -hmm. Good. What are you writing down there, Maida? It says ma making. Oh, good. Making. Making is taken, oh, guys. Good, but but it is good, Maida. We understand. Me sale abajo, pero no, no puedo mucho. Pero está bueno, aunque le salga así de grande, pero está bien. Ok. Good, good. Good, Daisy. Mm -hmm. Okay, is there any missing? No, right? We, I think we finished here. Yeah, preparing, good, good. 
Remember the three rules that we studied in this module is, uh, I'm sorry, are that you drop letter E in the verbs that end with the letter E. Examples, manage, have, supervise, prepare, make, take, okay? And you double the consonant, the, the ending consonant if you have consonant, vowel, consonant. Ok, bien. Solo quiero hacerles una pequeña observación. Lo han hecho muy bien, muy, muy bien. ¿Verdad? A la hora de escribir, cuando nos toca escribir el inglés, okay, um, tengamos siempre presente que, bueno, para nosotros que ya somos adultos y que lo primero que queremos ver es algo escrito como para entenderlo, ok, eh, tenemos que usar mucho la memoria, ¿verdad? Tenemos que usar mucho la memoria para poder eh, escribir correctamente. Pero la mejor forma es practicar. Practicar, practicar. Ok. I'm going to stop sharing at this moment. Ok. You did a very good job. Y la otra cosa es que he notado eh, que en el momento en que yo eh, hablo completamente en inglés, eh, veo algunos ojos que mejor miran para otro lado y no es eh, la actitud que se debe de tomar. Al contrario, debe de ponerse más atención para que usted pueda entender, porque es, 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 eh, la práctica es el maestro, ¿verdad? Entonces, para que usted, usted dice, es que no entiendo cuando, cuando lo hablan. Nunca lo va a entender si no le pone atención, ¿ok? Así que... Cuando yo hablo en inglés, póngale más el cerebro ahí, más el oído atento, ¿ok? En lugar de, eh, ah, eh, a veces se da por esto, porque no entendió una palabra, cree que no va a entender lo demás, pero no es así. No entendió esta palabra, pero lo demás sí lo puede captar palabras por aquí, por allá, y agarra una idea completa, ¿ok? Bien, eso es nada más como un tip. ¿Verdad? Bien, vamos a ir entonces en nuestro manual, porque en nuestro manual, en la página 34, ok, page 34, let me open this because I closed it, because of the memory of the computer. So, um, and page 34 is a thing that we didn't study in um in a long way so we're gonna check it out here we go Okay, in, uh, please, everybody go to your page 34. Okay. Here we are. Here we go. Okay, here we have a little a short conversation. It's not so so long. So we're gonna practice this conversation because uh, these two girls are talking about uh, events that are taking place at their workplaces. Uh, for example, I don't know if in your companies you have events or celebrations or um, you have a date with a scheduled activities. So now we are going to see if this match, okay? If, if this matches with the activities that you do in your workplaces, okay? So let's read it. Rose and Mary. Hello, Mary. What are some activities you are doing this week? 
Hi, Rose. Well, there are many things I am doing this week. For example, I am signing some payrolls on Tuesday and sending emails on Wednesday. And you? That's okay. I am talking to colleagues and checking reports. And who is analyzing the advances in the company? Peter is. Again, hello, Mary. What are some activities you are doing this week? Hi, Rose. Well, there are many things I am doing this week. For example, I am signing some payrolls on Tuesday and sending emails on Wednesday. And you? That's okay. I'm talking to colleagues and checking reports. And who is analyzing the advances in the company? Peter is. Okay. Do you have any question about the vocabulary in this conversation? What are they talking about? Payrolls, what does it, what does payroll means? Um, payrolls are the um, planillas. Ah, oh, okay, 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 thanks. Mm -hmm. What are they talking about? What are they talking about? About the activities that they do uh, in a week. Okay, activities they have scheduled, right? For these yes. days, for these yes. days in the present, yeah? And the present means um, period of time near the one I am talking, right? So yeah. they say uh, these are activities that they are doing this week. Thank you, Nestor. So let's see, and uh, let's try to discuss this or find the answers to these questions. What are some activities Mary is doing this week? What are some activities Mary is doing this week? Sending email. Okay. Mm -hmm. And dining some payrolls. Okay. Okay. Each activity is in a specific day, right? These are scheduled activities. So sending emails on Wednesday. Okay and signing some payrolls on Tuesday. Great, on Tuesday, good. Are you doing some of the activities described above? Hay alguna de estas actividades que hagan así, que sí peguen con alguna que ustedes tienen que hacer en su trabajo? Yes, teacher. Okay, which ones? I And I sending emails. Okay, just, aquí no le ponemos el sujeto, sino que solamente el verbo y la actividad, okay? Mire, aquí no le puse yo eh, ningún sujeto, ¿verdad? Entonces vamos a poner solo la actividad. Sending, okay, sending emails. Ajá. What How, else? Talking to college. Okay. Talking to colleagues, co Please. yes, colleagues. Mm -hmm. And checking report. Good. Good. Okay, great. Do you analyze the advances in the company? 
who analyzes the advances in your company or who is analyzing the advances in your company? Who? The engineer. Okay. Did you say something, Patricia? We couldn't hear you. For example, when analyzing and analyzing the advance, um, what is oh, a qué se refiere? Analyzing the advances. Mm -hmm. Um, eh, lo que hace un analista. Okay, lo que hace un analista, comparar entradas, salidas, ganancias, eh, comparar como es el, el, el avance de la compañía. Uh -huh. y, y al mismo tiempo propone, ¿verdad? Estrategias para eh, superar errores como un auditor también, ¿verdad? Puede hacer ese tipo de trabajo, analyzing the advances. Por right. ejemplo, uh, in my company, I have... Indicadores, indicadores. Ok, indicadores. Ajá. Ajá, yes. La medición de la ISO. Oh, ok. ISO indicators, ok. Uh -huh. Like a standards, right? Ok. Oh, RPCA o oh, buenas prácticas de manufactura. Ok, and are you in charge of that? Yeah. Are you in charge of doing it? Mm, mm, mm. Or who is in charge of analyzing these standards or these indicators in your company? Uh, mm, I, I. Okay, so good, good. So you do some activities that they are uh, saying here. Okay, so yes, Patricia uh, is analyzing the advances or the indicators, right, in her company. Good, 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 good. So you could say it like that, Patricia. I am analyzing the advances mm -hmm. in my company or I am analyzing the indicators in my company, okay? Mm -hmm. I am analyzing the in ISO indicators in my company, okay? So now guys, we're going to continue with the other activity over here. We have to fill in the blanks with the events um, you have at the workplaces, at your workplaces, okay? There is this. And let's see, for example, they started giving you the examples like signing payroll, sending emails, analyzing the advances. What other activities or events you have scheduled at your workplaces? Mm -hmm. Calling clients. Okay, good. Very good. Mm -hmm. What else? Check inventory. Okay, aquí le vamos a poner el ING. Okay, checking inventory. Inventory. Mm -hmm. Visiting clients. Arranging meeting. Good. Attending clients. Mm -hmm. Attending clients. Mm -hmm. Writing report. Bien, en, solo déjenme hacer una aclaración. Attending es asistir, pero es como llegar, hacer número, ¿verdad? En un lugar. Atender los clientes, 
no es attending, es assisting, ¿ok? Assisting. Ah. O sea, okay. que, o sea que es a four friends, teacher. Excuse me? So it's at false friends. At false friends? I can't get well, it. Eh, cuando this, por ejemplo, es este, eh, embarrassing, pensamos que es embarazada. Algo así, oh, que, oh, yeah, yeah. Oh, a false, oh, yes. Okay, yes, yes, yes. Okay, okay. yeah. Yes, it is like that. Y usualmente pensamos que atten, attending es atender, but no, it is yes. not. Okay, it's assisting. Okay, mm -hmm. okay. okay, good. So number nine, uh, you said two more. Patricia, which one did you say? And Nestor, what did you say? I don't remember. Uh, write a report. Okay, and what did you say, Patricia? Attending meeting. Ah, uh, yeah, okay. Organizing, organizing, okay. Organizing. Mm -hmm. Arrange meetings. I don't know what this thing quedó así. Okay. Vamos a ponerlo así. I'm sorry, no voy a buscarle el otro lado. Oops. Okay. And organizing. Good. Oops. Organizing meetings. And which one was the other? Attending meetings. Okay, here we go. So yes, these are some events. Event means activities that are scheduled, okay? Scheduled activities for this week, for the next week, planned, planned activities, okay? Planning, yeah, planning. So let's continue. Let's continue because we have a reading right here, right here to. Uh, to develop these skills. OK, so let me read the instructions. And uh, here it says, read this article about activities to keep employees happy. Discuss if the sentences below are true are false and correct the false one, the false ones. What, it, what does it mean? We have to read all the article. It's talking about the activities um, that you can practice in your company to keep employees happy, okay? And then we are going to discuss the um, statement below, if they are false or if they are true. Now, I'm going to stop sharing and I'm going to take you over here because I have um, an audio prepared, okay? For us to make this activity easier. Here we go. Here we go. Here. So let's see. Así en una forma general ahorita, what activities are they talking about? Let's see number one, what does it say? Can you read activity number one? A nice job of Okay, and activity number two? Celebrate buildings. Activity number three? Painful. Activity number four? Guess who? Guess who? Okay, now let's listen to the audio and read along, okay? Activities to keep your employees happy. Number one, organize yoga classes. If you work in an office and your employees are sitting at computers every day, don't underestimate the impact yoga could have on their attitude and outlook. Yoga can help alleviate stress, calm the mind, release tension, improve brain function, and lift mood. What boss wouldn't want those outcomes? Number two, celebrate birthdays. 
you don't just have to rely on business games to boost morale. Simply acknowledging special occasions can have a big impact. It shows your team that you care about them as people, not just as employees. Get everyone to sign a card, have cake once a month, or simply buy them a round of coffees each time someone in your team has a birthday. Number 3. Paintball. Give your employees an opportunity to laugh off some team by organizing a day of paintball. Simply getting out of the office can work wonders for staff morale. Watch out though, as the boss, you're going to be a prime target. Number 4. Guess who? Ask everyone to bring a childhood photo of themselves and put them all up in a board and get everyone to put their best guesses forward on each one. It's a bit of easy, light-hearted fun that will definitely help lift spirits while offering plenty of humor along the way. Okay, let's listen to that again. Vamos a comenzar desde number one, okay? Activities to keep your employees happy. Number one, organize yoga classes. If you work in an office and your employees are sitting at computers every day, don't underestimate the impact yoga could have on their attitude and outlook. Yoga can help alleviate stress, calm the mind, release tension, improve brain function, and lift mood. What boss wouldn't want those outcomes? Number two, celebrate birthdays. You don't just have to rely on business games to boost morale. Simply acknowledging special occasions can have a big impact. It shows your team that you care about them as people, not just as employees. Get everyone to sign a card, have cake once a month, or simply buy them a round of coffees each time someone in your team has a birthday. Number 3. Paintball Give your employees an opportunity to laugh off some team by organizing a day of paintball. Simply getting out of the office can work wonders for staff morale. Watch out though, as the boss, you're going to be a prime target. Number 4. Guess who? Ask everyone to bring a childhood photo of themselves and put them all up in a board and get everyone to put their best guesses forward on each one. It's a bit of easy, light-hearted fun that will definitely help lift spirits while offering plenty of humor along the way. Okay. Do you have any question about the vocabulary in this reading and this article? And the number two? Simply acknowledging, acknowledging, simply acknowledging. Quiere decir con la simple, simple dada a conocer, okay? Con solo dar a conocer. Okay. Mm -hmm. uh I have a question, teacher. What is pronunciation in number one? Uh, alleviate, alleviate, alleviate. Alleviate. Ah, alleviate. Alleviate. Uh, okay, alleviate. Okay, alleviate. Thanks. Okay. And I have a question in number four. Uh huh. Brain, uh, childhood. childhood photo childhood photo a photo when you you were a child okay childhood is como eh, la época que se llama niñez okay una foto de su niñez right a childhood photo nosotros en español dijéramos así que traigan una foto cuando eran chiquitos yeah. Uh, yeah. yeah. Okay. Childhood is niñez. Teacher, and the next word uh, for the childhood photo, the themselves. Of themselves. Okay. 
una foto mía o una foto de ellos, de ellos, quiere decir themselves, de ellos mismos, que no van a traer la foto de otro, ¿verdad? <ríe> Sino que la foto de ellos mismos. Mm -hmm. No more questions? Okay, then let's start reading. Um, who wants to participate reading number one? Me, teacher. Okay, go ahead, please. Okay. If you work in an office and your employees... I'm sorry, Nestor. I'm going to stop you here because you have to write from the beginning, uh, to read from the beginning, okay? Number one, oh, organize... Okay. Organize okay. yoga class. Uh, if you work in an office and your employees are sitting at computer every day, don't under underestimate Underestimate, underestimate. Underestimate. The impact yoga could have uh, on their attitude and outlook. And outlook. Yoga can help uh, alleviate stress, calm the mind, release tension, improve brain function and live mood what what boss would wouldn't want those outcomes okay good thank you very much who wants to participate reading number two uh, i teacher okay do it marco okay number two say celebrate birthdays you don't just have to really on business games to boss moral moral Morale. Ah, morale. Simply acknowledging special occasions can have a big impact. It shows your team that you care about them as, as people, not just as employees. Get everyone to sing a card. To have sign. They... To sign, sign. a card. Ah, sorry, 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 sorry. It's a small letter. <laughs> uh, okay, sign a uh, card. Have K one, once a month. Or simply buy them a, a, a round or a, a round? Round. Round. A round? Mm -hmm. Ah, okay. A round of coffees each time someone in your team has a birthday. Okay, thank you very much. Who wants to read number three? Me. Any? Number three, painful. Give your employees an opportunity to live on some steam the organizing a day of painful simply like getting off out of the office can work wonders for staff moral watch out watch out don't as the boss you're going to be a prime target thank you very much linda Okay, great. And here there is like an irony or like a, yeah, something ironic, right? Because it's giving advice here. Watch out though, as the boss, you're going to be a prime target, okay? Al jugar paintball, le dice, y ten cuidado porque como el jefe a vos te van a ir a dar todos primero, ¿verdad? O sea, es como irónica esa parte, es divertida, ¿ok? It's really fun. Thank you very much, Linda. Now, number four, who wants to read it? Who wants to participate reading number four? Not too sure. Okay, go ahead, Patty. Guess who? As every time you bring a shield home photo of themselves and 
then a lab um, board, and then get every job. Everyone, everyone. Ay, perdón, everyone. To put the best guesses for what? On each one, it's a bit of easy life. Career from that will definitely have less spirit while offering plenty of more along the way. Okay. While, while, while is mientras, okay, while offering plenty, mientras ofrece, uff, un montón de humor, una gran cantidad de humor along the way, a lo largo de todo el, el evento, ¿verdad? Se divierten, da humor, ok. Is it okay now? Yes. Okay. Plenty es una gran cantidad, mucho. Okay, plenty es mucho. Okay, um, bastante. Okay, bastante. And it says plenty of humor, una bastante humor. Okay. Along means you are going through. Okay, the way. Todo el tiempo que eso dura, ¿verdad? Ok. Ok, guys. So, is there any question so far about this reading? Is there anyone who wants to participate? Even though we finish number four, we can start from number one. We can start over if you want to participate. Do you want to participate, uh, Mayra, reading number one? No Mayra there, okay. Oh yes, there she is, Mayra. You're muted. Yeah, your microphone is not on. Ahora sí me escucha. Yes, now we do. Mm -hmm. Es que no me funciona el aparatito ese. Oh, okay, okay. Ahorita, el uh, number one. Yes, please. Okay, voy a decir. Dice, eh, organize your class. Is you work in an office and your employers are sitting in the computer every day. Don't. Eh, esa palabra. Underestimating the impact yoga could have on their attitude and outlook. Yoga can help alleviate stress, can diminish class tension. Improve brain function and the life mom. What both uh, you met? Wouldn't. Wouldn't. I see, mire. Wouldn't. Golden. Golden one, two outcomes. Okay, outcomes. good. Good, good. A ver, ¿quién eh, quiere decirme qué significa esta última oración? A ver, ¿qué quiere decir esta última pregunta? What bus wouldn't want those outcomes? Ajá. Uh -huh. Someone? Anyone? ¿Qué? Ah, de acuerdo. Sorry. It activated because it's right down my, my hand. Mhm. Uh -huh. ¿Qué querrá decir esta, esta pregunta? You're muted. Uh -huh. Result, teacher. Yes, the results. So, what do you think? What, um, what boss 
que jefe no Pero quisiera, eso es okay, no querría o no quisiera esos resultados. ¿Qué ¿verdad? jefe no, que, no, que, no quisiera esos resultados? Correct. There you are. Mm -hmm. There you go. Okay. What boss wouldn't want those costs? Outcomes. 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 Okay. Mm -hmm. Interesting. What It's outcomes? What outcomes, outcomes are they talking Out about? Out outcome. Yes, but what outcomes are they talking about in this question? Okay. They are talking about... about Teacher, what about outlook? What does outlook es mean? Una mirada, una vista, okay? Uh, Así como eh, sobre todo, una vista lista, right? Uh, mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah. It's like sight. Yes, but outlook is like, hasta se puede usar como revisar, right? Like ah, okay, Something okay. like that. But it means to uh, have an eye on the things, right? Have an okay. eye on the things. Yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay, guys. Eh, los outcomes a los que se refiere acá son los resultados o eh, el impacto que causa el yoga en los eh, empleados, ¿verdad? O entre los trabajadores. Which outcomes are those? ¿Cuáles son esos resultados? Which outcomes are those? Ah, yoga can help alleviate stress, calm the mind, release tension, improve brain functions and live mood. Imagine an employee with these characteristics, no stressed, focused, right? And with a very good mood, okay, to work, they are ready to work. That, that those out outcomes are the ones that this question is uh, referring to, okay? Bien. Vamos a ver, who wants to read number two? Who wants to read number two? Cecia, do you want? Okay, teacher. Okay. Number two, celebrate birthdays. You don't just have to really, really, or rely, rely, rely. Okay. You don't just have to rely on business gain. To boost moral, moral, simply, simply acknowledging, acknowledging uh -huh. special occasions can have a big impact. It shows your team that you care about them as people, not just as employees. Get everyone to sing a car. To have, sign. To sign a car, have case once a month, or simply buy ten around. All coffees, eat time song someone is your thing as a birthday. Okay. Do they celebrate your birthdays in your company? Yes. Yes. Okay. Yes. Okay. And what about yours, guys? How do you use to celebrate your birthdays in your company? Do you celebrate birthdays? Um, yes. Can you describe your celebrations? In the office, yes. Ahora con office, no. Oh, yeah, you're right. Even though you can do it virtually, right? <laughs> mm -hmm. Like a virtual meeting, okay? And everybody's sending um, a house. deliveries to your house, right? Uh, they can send gifts. They can send you um, cards or, or uh, these flower pots, right? So, <laughs> yes, you're right. It's very interesting, your point. <laughs> When we go uh, to the office, okay, yes, right? They celebrate our birthdays. But now, you know, with the pandemic, I saw in a company that uh, well, it was the worst 
of the pandemic. Imagine uh, it was last year and uh, they, they wanted to cut a cake, but uh, it was not permitted. Okay, it was not permitted. Why? Because of the contamination, right? Because of the contagious of the virus. So what did we do? Uh, we just give to the to the um, birthday person uh, the whole cake. Okay, the whole cake. We couldn't cut the cake in the office. Okay, no, no podíamos partir el pastel en la oficina, así que se lo teníamos que dar entero, ¿verdad? Se lo teníamos que dar entero, tapadito, así selladito, tal como lo traían del domicilio, ¿verdad? Porque era lo duro de la pandemia en ese momento. Entonces no se podía partir el pastel y que soplara las velitas. No way, it's not possible, right? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Did you have any experience uh, like that? ¿Alguien tuvo alguna experiencia así? Celebrando cumpleaños en medio de la pandemia? No, teacher, in my case, no, because my birthday is in January. <laughs> oh, okay, okay. Yeah, it was really hard that time. Yeah, it was really hard. Yes, too much restrictions. Yes. Okay, then, um, is there any question about what we read tonight? ¿Hay alguna pregunta acerca de lo que hemos leído? No questions, because now it's your turn, ¿ok? Ahora es su turno. Primero voy a tomar la asistencia, ¿ok? First I'm going to take the attendance and then I'm going to break out the rooms to... Um, para que ustedes hagan la actividad que está abajo, ¿ok? Ahí en la página eh, es 35, right? Uh, de falso y verdadero. Just let me call the roll. Alba Janet López Ábalos. Present. Cecia Gemima Pérez Cideos. Present. David Alejandro Choto Martínez. Um, Delmi Isabel Dera Salguero. Present. Daisy Calo Carolina Sánchez Nieto. Present. Grecia Tatiana Rosales Campos. No, Grecia. Juan Diego López Palacios. Linda Alicia Valladares Argueta. Present. Luz Verónica Trujillo de Urbina. Present. Marco Adonai Villeda Alvarado. Present, teacher. Sorry. Um, Mayra Yanira Alfaro Posada. Present, teacher. Néstor Ariel Garzona Asensio. Present teacher. Okay. Pablo Alberto Magaña Molina. Present. Patricia Eugenia Navarro de Rosales. Present teacher. Roxana Marilyn Pérez Ortiz. Present teacher. Okay, thank you very much. I appreciate your responsibility, guys. Uh, it's very important for in-support uh, requirements, the attendance, okay? So thank you very much for your responsibility. And I encourage you uh, to um, not to miss, okay? Not to miss any class from now to the end. Porque ya vamos a entrar a la última, mañana entramos a la última unidad y ya es como la última oportunidad, ¿verdad? Para no perder los puntos de la asistencia. De aquí para allá, les sugiero que no se les ocurra faltar, ¿verdad? Y que no se les ocurra eh, desconectarse antes o entrar después. Porque cada minutito cuenta para poder llegar al porcentaje. Acuérdense que si no, después no somos tomados en cuenta, ¿verdad? Bien. 
Ahorita vamos a hacer los grupos. I'm going to break out the rooms. And you are going to uh, discuss if each statement below the reading are false or um, true. Okay. Bien. ¿Sí se entiende lo que van a ir a hacer? Preguntas. Uh, repeat, please, teacher. I repeat, no. please. Okay. You have to discuss with your partner each statement below the reading. You have to say if it is true or if it is false. And if it is false, you have to correct. Okay. To correct the false ones. Okay. Is it okay now? Ok, okay. Okay. ok. ok. Bien, y por respeto y amor a su compañero que va a quedar con usted, por favor participe con todo, ¿verdad? No se me le vaya al compañero, no se me le quede calladito, ¿ok? Porque se pierde el objetivo de la actividad, ¿verdad? La idea es to speak, to talk, conversation, ¿ok? Use your vocabulary as much as you can. There we go. I think we're good. There we go. Roxana, ¿recibió la invitación a unirse? Roxana. Ok. Hello, teacher. Hello. How is it going? Did you share the, the screenshot? Okay. From the... Ok, these are the statements. Acuérdense que esto es del manual, el manual en la página 34, page okay. 34. Ok. Néstor. Yoga has an important effect on employees. Is true or false? ¿Ya lo agarraron? Yes. Yes, um, sir, yes. Thank okay. you. Thank you so much. Okay. Okay. There it is. Okay. Okay, teacher. Okay, ahí está. Hola. Hola, Patricia. Hello. Hi, Patricia. So, uh, ask me the question. 
Yes. And I will ask me a question, the number one, and I, I will ask you, I'm going to ask you the question number two. And then okay. the two, number one. Number four. Okay. Do I have some important effect on employees? Is true or false? I am reflect. It's true. It's true. It's true. It is true. Uh, how do you know um, when you were uh, in from uh, the computer? You sometimes you feel the stress because you are all the time uh, it is uh, typing, uh, writing report, writing a letter. Uh, anyway, uh, so you sometimes you feel the stress. So uh, if you do yoga, you can feel better. I think it's important. Mm -hmm. If effect on um, employees. So what about you? Yoga re releases tension, but it doesn't calm the mind. What do you think? It is true or is false? No, it's, it's false. False. Simply, yeah. This uh, getting out, out of office. He uh, this uh, inside. Inside the office. And answer is false. It's false. Okay, then put them all up, up one and they get everyone to put their heads together. No me sale para compartirla. A ver. Solo que le tome foto. Porque no me, no me sale. No. Pero sí salió. Yo sí la vi. Yo sí la vi cuando entré. Liz, entonces es esa, la 36. Es, es que no estaba muy seguro. 34. 34. 34. ¿Verdad que es lo de las lecturas? Las cuatro. Exacto. Uh -huh. Ah, ok. Entonces sí, adiós, Pablo, que era esa la lectura. Ah, Ahorita lo voy a compartir. Ah, bueno. Ahorita lo comparto. Okay. Tenemos que, que practicar esa lectura. Ahorita. Vamos a ver. Qué foto. Mira Pablo si la ve. Yes. Va, entonces es de, es de, es de compartir la lectura. Si quiere, eh, comienzo. Eh, Juan. Eh, no, ¿Vale? no es la lectura en sí, es que conteste lo de abajo. Estas. Eh... Ah, 
ya, ah, pues en eso sí que Verdadero y falso, right? True or yeah. false. Tienes en relación a, a, a la lectura, ¿verdad? Yes, la yes, cual. it is. Okay. Yes, it is. Ah, ok. Mm -hmm. Vale, entonces practiquemos, Pablo. Dice en la one, dice el gancho burgués. Dice en one, yoga is a post infectivo deployed. Sería true. Quiero ver si podemos con el lapicito, pero no sabes. Sería true. Ahí le puse una rayita, digamos que sí va. Sí, yes. ¿Verdad que está bien? Sí. Yes. Ok, quiero ver la pista. Sería una rueda. No me sale. Resaltar. Ah, ok. Ahí sí, va. De ahí, ok, seguimos. Sí, dice. No me do. Yoga reels tension, but I don't can demit. Quiero ver si dice. False. Yoga. Yoga de heal and alivia de estrés, la tensión. La tensión. Es eh, eh, falso. Es falso porque no, no es falso. Está es falso. Es falso. Okay. Dice la nombre aquí. No. Y aquí dice no. adentro del... Ah, pues es falso. Ah, ese es falso, sí. Vale. Y la última... Charhot Forest Can Open. Office Employee. And... Esa creo que es falsa también. Okay. Bueno, no sé por qué. Dice como que... No. Si las fotos... De las fotos de la niñez... Pueden ofender a los empleados. Mm. Eso es falso, porque en el texto dice pedir ¿Cómo sería como una? No, no creo. Number one, photo. Uh -huh. uh -huh. And number three, say, based on the reading, special occasions are not important. Um, organize yoga class, celebrate. El paintball. Paintball is uh, activity uh, joy. Uh, mm. You should guess who. Um, I confuse in number three. <laughs> sí. um, based in reading, special occasions are not important. Que no important. Bueno, los cumpleaños siempre los celebro. <laughs> yoga. I not practice yoga. <laughs> ni yo. Ni, ni el paintball. Ah, paintball. Este. Uh, uh, next, next question, <laughs> because number three is confused. <laughs> Hello, how's it going? Hello. Hi, teacher. How are you doing here? In corner three. Yes, uh -huh. I was hearing. Mm -hmm. What do you think about uh, the reading says? It says, based on the reading, Special occasions are not important. Veamos en donde habló de las ocasiones especiales. Where in the reading we can find the special occasions. 
Celebrate mm -hmm. birthday, number okay. two. Okay. okay. Mm -hmm. And what does it say? Is it important or isn't important? Isn't it important? Yes, because the reading say acknowledging special occasions can have a big impact. Okay, then what do you think? Is it true or is it false? Special occasions are not important. It's important. It's important. Okay, it's then special. we can say, is it true or is it false? True. Uh, in this case, number three is la oración esa es verdadera o esa oración es falsa? Ah, false, 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 There you are. Okay, great, guys. Continue, continue. Mm. False, 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 okay. false. Uh-huh. Workers can play in pain inside uh, the work. office. Um, give your employees an opportunity to live off some stream be organizing a day of pain bars simply getting getting out of the office can work wonder for that moral what inside i don't i don't remember Hello, girls. How are you doing here? Hello, teacher. Hello, did, teacher. Did you finish? Yes, teacher. Yes, teacher. Okay. Um, take advantage and, and practice the reading. Practice something here uh, until your classmates finish, okay? Okay. Okay. Okay, guys, here they are, the questions. Mm, they are not questions, they are statements. So, <clears throat> Grecia, number one, yoga has an important effect of, on employees. What do you think? Is it true or is it false? True. Okay. Uh, can you tell me why is it true? Why it is true? Yes. Okay, why, Grecia? Mm. 
Sí, true, true, true. Vaya ahí en la lectura y lea en dónde está la oración en donde usted encontró esto. Mar. Importa. Bueno, que tenga la importante. No. Pero dice que yoga. English, please. If you work in the office and your employees are sitting computerly, don't. But the yoga can be yoga happy a little stress. Anyone can help? Um... Grecia saying, why do you think that it is true? Bueno, que sea importante si no, pues no, no está. No, it doesn't say, but uh, of course it yeah. is. Teacher. Right? Yes, tell me. Uh, I think yoga has an important effect on employees. Mm -hmm. Because uh, when someone uh, is uh, on the computer all the time, writing a letter, uh, typing a, re a letter or report, uh, and some some um, moment he he going he going to feel uh, stress uh, if he has a lot of work. So I think uh, the yoga has an important effect. Uh, could you do? You relax your mind, your body, you know, so okay. you feel uh, rest. Okay, rested. Mm -hmm. yeah, rested. Okay, good, good. And according to the reading, okay, our, according to the reading, we could uh, I conclude, right, that of course yoga has an important effect on employees, right? Number yeah. two, it says, Yoga releases tension, but it doesn't calm the mind. What do you think, Cezia? Is this true or is this false? It's false. False? Okay, why is it false? Because is yoga, the yoga, mm -hmm. ca calm the mind. Okay, great. Here is a negative, right? That you're saying no, doesn't, right? Doesn't calm the mind. But in the reading, we um, we saw that, of course, yoga calm the mind, right? Okay, thank you very much, uh, Cecia. Now, number three. Ahora, al que le pregunte, le. El statement me dice si es true o si es false y me dice por qué, ¿ok? Number three, Alba, please. Uh, based on the rating, special occasion are not important. Is uh, false. Releases tension. Uh, because um, because, because um, for some play acknowledging special acknowledging acknowledging, acknowledging a special occasion can have a big Impact. Okay, good, good, Alba. Now, Linda, please, number four. A worker can play pinball inside the office. <coughs> Is false. What? 
Eh, because is. ¿Cómo se dice? Fuera de la. Uh, going out or getting out? Getting out. Getting out the office. Okay. Okay. Good. Good. Yes, because imagine it's not possible to play paintball in an office. What a mess we can make, right? Uh, it yeah. will be really a mess. And I think <laughs> no one, eh, en su sano juicio, nadie lo va a hacer adentro, right? So, uh, <laughs> yeah, and well being, no, of course not. Of course not. Well thinking, mm -mm, no. Yeah. Okay, let's see. Number five. Number five, please. Um, one second. Roxana, please. Childhood. Childhood. Childhood photo in Afghan employees. It falls. Because um, ask everyone to buy a childhood, childhood photo of themselves. Okay, okay. And what, what, what you? Do, I'm sorry. Have you yes. ever, have you ever done this activity in your places, in your workplaces? Alguna vez han hecho esto en su trabajo? Uh, no. Taking your childhood photos? No. no? Yes, in my work, yes. Okay, and how was it? Uh, how was it? Can you describe the activity? Um, in a day of child, uh, ah. uh, yes, uh, posting a photograph in, um, what? Posting a photograph. Photo. In the intranet. Yes. Okay. In the internal, internal, internal um, network. Network, exactly. And uh, participating in a, how do you say, concurso? In uh, a contest. In a contest, uh huh. Okay, nice. Did you win? Fire. Never. <laughs> Never. <laughs> okay, what was the prize? ¿Cuál era el premio? What was the prize? Uh, gift, gift, oh. yeah, of the man on. Oh, uh -huh. good. Mm -hmm. Gift cards. Uh -huh. Gift card, gift card. Nice. So I will participate if I would know. <laughs> nice, nice. And did you have fun doing that activity, Marco? Yes, yeah, because it's all day um, play games eating food and celebrate other activities in in child day okay nice mm -hmm. this is very good it's the childhood day okay okay ah, childhood okay. yes uh-huh okay now we are going to continue this was very nice and we know now the activities we can do in our workplaces to keep up the mood of our uh, co-workers or uh, the employees, right, in general. Okay, I'm going to stop sharing at this moment here because this was the last thing. Ahora, solo nos queda una actividad de la unidad 3 que la haremos el día de mañana al iniciar la clase para hacer el feedback, ¿verdad? Y vamos ahorita a jugar. Just give me one second. It says 940, yeah. Okay, so we're going to play um, um, quizás uh, por el tiempo que llevamos, nos tomó más tiempo la, la lectura, pero era importante, okay, um, porque, no, vamos a cambiar, vamos a cambiar el juego, okay, y nos vamos a ir a lo del email, vamos todos a la plataforma, let's go to the platform, over there, I send. One second. 
Over there, I, I posted a discussion, a question, right, in the label of, this, of discussions. And I want you to please now, okay, direct a message to a classmate right now, describing your activities that you have scheduled for this week or the next week, okay? Just let me get there because for some reason I cannot open the... Okay, here it is, here it is, here it is. Mm -hmm. Just let me put it ready, get it ready. Term. Ok, escojan ahorita a quién le quieren enviar un mensaje ahí por la plataforma. Choose a classmate. For example, Patty, who do you want to work, uh, work with? A quién le quiere enviar un mensaje ahí en la plataforma describiéndole sus actividades eh, ya programadas. For example, uh, Marco. Okay, Marco, you are going to receive a message from Patty, okay? And you are going to answer to Patty. Uh, okay, and, copy uh, You are going to reply, uh, reply to her. Okay, um, and so on, okay? Daisy, who do you want to work with? Alba. Okay, Alba, Alba and Daisy. Cecia, choose a classmate. Mm. Eh, Linda. Teacher, yo no me puedo conectar en la plataforma. ¿No puede entrar ahorita o no ha podido entrar antes? ¿Solo ahorita? Mayra. No. Donde se hacen lo de las tareas, sí entro. Ajá. ¿Y luego a dónde me voy? Ah, ok. Ahorita voy a compartir yo. Solo estamos... Eh, Escogiendo con quién va a trabajar cada uno para que ya yo pueda compartir la pantalla, ¿ok? Ah. Y ahí le muestro cómo. Ok, Cecia, who do you want to work with? Linda. Ok, Linda and Cecia. Now, uh, Nestor, who do you want to work with? No sé quién está en vivo, Usted diga y ahí le van a decir. Yo ya estoy, le van a decir. Uh -huh. Daisy. Ok, ya está. Vamos a ver. Entonces lo pongo de una vez con David. Ok. David, are you okay. there? David. Ok. Yes, yes. Ok, yes, you are I'm going here. to work with Nestor. Ok. Grecia. Okay. Grecia, who do you want to work with? Está Luz, está Mayra, está Pablo y está Delmi. Mayra. Ok, Mayra, you are going to work with Grecia, ok? Ok. Delmi, who do you want to work with? We cannot hear you. Nos queda Luz y Pablo. Trabajan los tres juntos, ¿ok? okay. Los tres se envían entre ustedes, ¿ok? Se dirigen hacia, hacia entre los tres. Luz, Pablo y Delmi, ¿ok? Ok, okay, okay then. I'm going to share the screen because over there we're going to post, right? We're going to post our message like a bien Mayra mire cuando usted abre su plataforma usted tiene aquí el menú mire arriba en este menú usted pone discussion ok le da clic y le va a aparecer esto aquí donde dice all topics ok ok Ahí está cargando. Espera. 
Aquí donde dice all topics, you click on all topics. And then you have describing scheduled activities. Le da click aquí. Describing scheduled activities. This is the instruction. The, these are the instructions. Uh, voy a probar exactly. ahorita. Exactly. Okay. Vamos a leer qué dice. A ver, uh, Alba, please. Can you read? Write an email to your partner describing some of the scheduled, scheduled, scheduled activities you have to do in your job this and next week using present continuous, affirmative, negative, and question. The more you use class, Vocabulary de Pedro. Ok. ¿Qué quiere decir? Que no busquemos lo que no sabemos. Utilicemos lo que ya sabemos. Por eso se llama práctica y eh, que lo estamos volviendo a, a ver, ¿verdad? Cualquier cosa que hay duda se hace de acuerdo a lo que, se, lo que hemos visto en el manual. Ok. Para poder hacer el post aquí, solo dejen de mover un poco. Ok, aquí está el cuadrito, miren, los que nunca han entrado a este label, ok, aquí en este cuadrito usted va a escribir su mensaje. ¿Cómo se escribe un email? Ok, vamos a hacer como que aquí fuera el email. Entonces, le vamos a poner el subject, ok, le vamos a poner primero to aquí, to, ok. Y le ponemos ahí una email address. Ok, for example, I'm going to write ado villeda um, at um, hotmail.com. Ok, or dependiendo, right? Travers Inc. Travers uh, Inc. Dot com. Right? Una dirección inventada, ¿ok? Then, the subject es el tema de lo que va a tratar mi email, ¿verdad? Si yo le voy a decir mis actividades, puedo poner describing or, well, describing. Describing scheduled activities, ¿ok? For this and next week. Debiera ser bien cortito, pero estamos bien así. Ok, bien, me voy al asunto, ¿verdad? El asunto, le vamos a poner asunto así para que lo diferenciemos. Y entonces ya usted empieza con su saludo, ¿verdad? Dear uh, um, Marco, right? Dear Marco. Y empieza a poner, this week I am... Sending, okay, you go. The reports, this is an example. You are going to do it right now. I want to see, y cuando ustedes le vayan dando submitting, okay, van a ir apareciendo acá, okay? Así que comenzamos. Vamos a ver. Everybody, sending an email to your uh, partner. Okay, teacher. Okay. Okay. Sure, I have a question. Mm -hmm. How do you say este, imprimir libros legales? To print, or I'm sorry, printing the 
uh, I don't remember if it is the books or the accounting books or the accounting legal books. Thank you. Okay. Alguien le dio ya submit porque ya le di refresh y no me aparece ninguno todavía. Teacher, ¿podría poner el ejemplo? Ah, lo borré. Ok. Lo borré, eh, Nestor. Como le di refresh. Oh, oh. Uh -huh. uh, so, so. Yes. Ok, aquí está el cuadrito en donde van a trabajar. Then you have to write the email address. You can uh, figure it out or you can just invent or make up one, right? So, for example, you are writing to Ado Villeda, right? This is what I said. Uh, oh, invent. Sir. Yes. Okay. And then the subject, right? What I'm asking for, right? Scheduled yeah. activities, or you can also, whatever you want to say, but in this case, for example, planning activities for this and next week. Okay. And then you start writing, right? For example, okay. uh, in the um, in the body, you can say, for example, dear Marco, right? I'm sending the reports on Friday, right? Yeah, I'm not. 
para hacer una negativa, por ejemplo, I am not um, getting the information or the complete information. And you can write whatever you want, whatever you want, okay? Okay, teacher, thank you. Okay. Te pueden hacer preguntas, right? Are you um, having lunch early this week? Right? Things like that, yeah? And then you click on submit, okay? Okay, teacher. Okay, I will submit it even though it's going to seem kind of funny here. Okay, there we are. And it's going to seem like this. Okay. Okay. We have only two minutes, guys. I will stop sharing. Maybe that's the problem why he's getting it. Okay, time is up. So it's 10 o'clock. Please click on submit de lo que hayan hecho. Solo del en submit. Teacher, cuando yo escribo arroba me borra todo, ya lo intenté hacer un montón de veces y no me deja. Me regresa a, a notas, como que si en una nota quiero escribir. 
no entiendo por qué le diera ese problema, Luz. Cuando quise escribir la dirección de correo y le puse el signo arroba, me regresa a nota y me borra todo. ¿Pero está segura que está escribiendo en el cuadrito correcto? Sí, ahí igual el de la imagen que usted nos mostró. ¿Qué, qué teclas toca usted para hacer la robo? Al 64. Mm, quizás con alt está el asunto, quizás alt está para otra cosa. Oh, no, es que me sale, la, me, me, cuando la digito me sale, pero de allí me saca y me manda para notas. Para notas. Ajá, de la plataforma. Por eso, o sea, le está, le está haciendo como alt shift, uh, alt tab. O sea, la está mandando a otra. Ajá. Lo que ah, ahí solamente que en vez de al 64 tuviera al grado y Q o solamente Shift y el 2. No sé si lo tendrá en el 2 no, también. No, está en la Q, pero ya intenté hacerlo y no. La Q me sale. No, en la no Q, me sale de otra manera. Ponga otra cosa. Ponga la Q y yo voy a entender. No se complique con la arroba entonces, sino que póngale la Q y, y continúe. Es sí, que poner la arroba utilizo alt, pero del lado derecho. Donde exactamente. De, de, de desplazamiento y luego Q. Ajá, tiene que ser alt GR al grado. <coughs> I submit my email. Did you? Okay. Here it is. Teacher, can you see my email? Not yet. But it's on the way, it's on the, yes, Daisy, I can see it already. Yeah, it's going to Alba, right? Okay, excellent. Describing speech activities for this. Can and next week, email? right? Mm -hmm. Sí, es que tengo problemas con el teclado. A veces no me escriben las letras. Finish, teacher. Okay, thank you very much. Yes, I'm seeing Cecia here, Patricia, Roxana, just one second, let me see. No, no, you, Roxana is not showing yet. Delmi, good. David, Linda. Oh, yes, here you are, Roxana. Okay. And Marco, good. Patty, good. Okay, thank you very much for, for, participate, uh, for, uh, for participating in this uh, activity. And um, I will check it out, okay, during my uh, reviewing time. And I will tell you, okay, I will let you know how good you did it, okay? Just let me take, um, take the attendance for the third time and we're going to dismiss the class, okay? Alba Janet Lopez Avalos. Present. Okay. Remember to turn on your cameras and say present. Okay. Cecia Gemima Perez Fideos. Present. David Alejandro Choto Martinez. Present. Delmi Isabel Dera Salguero. Present. Daisy Carolina Sánchez Nieto. Present. Grecia Tatiana Rosales. Campos. Present. Okay. Juan Diego López Palacios. Linda Alicia Valladares Argueta. Present. Eh, Luz Verónica Trujillo de Urbina. Present. Marco Adonai Villeda Alvarado. 
present teacher, present. Okay. Mayra Yanira Alfaro Posada. Néstor Ariel Garza. Ok, Present, Mayra. teacher. Ok. Present. Estaba Present, queriendo teacher. enviar, yo creo que ya lo envié, pero no, no sé okay. dónde es que se ve. Ok. Pablo Alberto Magaña Present, Molina. Teacher. Ok. Thank Present, you, Néstor. Teacher. Ok, Pablo. Patricia Eugenia Navarro de Rosales. Roxana Marilín Pérez Ortiz. Present teacher. Ok. Eh, Mayra, eh, usted tiene que darle refresh a la página para que le aparezca. Ok. ¿Le da F5 o le da la flechita? La flechita redondita. Ok, miren, ahora le tocaba el turno a una niña pues que dejó el curso. Entonces... Um, ¿Está el, el turno disponible? ¿Hay alguien que quiera quedarse por alguna duda, una consulta o alguna práctica que quiera hacer? Me aflijo yo porque digo yo es que todos quieren y no puedo quedar bien con todo. Yo entonces me siento abrumada, fíjense. <risa> Ay, sí, no, es que es una barbaridad. Miren, ¿saben qué? Los vamos a reprogramar a cada uno, oye, para que pues cada uno tenga su turno. Ok. Miren, si tienen alguna duda, ok, háganmelo saber. No se queden con dudas. Que después ya vayan vi, a ver. Ya sí. aparecen todos, ¿verdad? Uh, ahorita voy a ver. Uh, lo que pasa es que no o sea, estoy en ya esa me vi que sí, que está como en la lista. Bueno, ok, ah, ok. Yo, yo voy a revisar y ahí les pongo sus respuestas, ¿verdad? En el momento que, ah. que ya yo reviso. Ok, lo que, que hubiera querido que hubiéramos visto aquí ¿verdad? todos, ¿verdad? Ok, uh, ¿qué estaba yo hablando? Uh, pues sí, um, pues sí, para que después no vayan a decir, ay, es que la teacher ni le podíamos preguntar. No, yo les pregunto. Miren, tienen una duda. Por favor, háganme saber. Porque no queremos que ustedes se vayan con dudas al otro módulo, ¿verdad? Que digan después allá, no es que ni nos explicó, ni nos dijo. No, al contrario. Aquí tiene que aprenderse todo lo que se necesita aprender para el siguiente módulo, ¿ok? Bien, acuérdense de hacer su tarea el día de hoy porque mañana... Eh, ya empezamos nueva unidad, ¿ok? La recta final la comenzamos mañana. Unidad 4. ¡Yay! Ajá. Ya es la recta final, chicos. ¿Cómo se sienten? <ríe> Cansados, ok. Pero sienten que hemos avanzado. A ver, aprovechemos un minuto nomás. Yes, in my case, I learned new vocabulary for my my jobs, my activities. Uh, it's interesting because, um, how do you say, por pena no hablo? <laughs> ah, because I'm ashamed of talking. I'm ashamed ah, okay. of talking. Uh -huh. Okay, uh -huh. I'm ashamed okay. of talking. <laughs> bueno, niño, hay que, mire, así, mire, hay que pasarse, ¿cómo se llama ese? El, eh, yo fui a uno que hacían eso, eh, unos masajes y todo, pero con una hoja grande que pica, que es bueno para el sistema nervioso. Entonces se lo pasan así, en todo, y pica. No me acuerdo cómo se llama ese. El chichicaste. Ok, el chichicaste, hacen esos masajes y hay sauna y todo eso y le ponen hasta eucalipto al sauna, buenísimo ahí en San Marcos. Entonces le iba a comentar eso, Marco, porque tiene que pasarse de ese, mire, chichicaste, así, chich, 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 por todo para avivar y que no, y que no tenga pena, ¿verdad? <ríe> no deben tener pena, hay que votar esa pena, todos, todos hay que votar esa pena, ríense, ríense, si usted se equivoca, ríense de su equivocación y continúe y aprenda la nueva, ¿ok? No, nadie le va a decir nada, al contrario, y, a, y miren, a veces cuando usted le dice algo a alguien en inglés, el otro pues ni sabe mucho, entonces usted va a quedar bien, ¿ok? Así que no se preocupe, al contrario, practique lo que ya sabe, dele marco con todo, no tenga pena, ¿ok? Copy, teacher, copy, copy. <ríe> ok, es que ese es buenísimo, lo hacen un manojo, les cuento, es 
realmente buenísimo para el sistema nervioso, le activa todo, pues y como pica, ¿verdad? Y es aquella cosa que le agarra, pero pasa rápido, pasa rápido el efecto. Uh -huh. Y después queda uno tranquilo, vieran qué chévere. Ok, guys, then class dismissed, time is up, so have a good rest, do your homework, and let us meet tomorrow. Bye bye. Bye. Good night, Good teacher. Night. Bye bye. 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 Teacher, algunas ¿Sí? discusiones ahorita le estoy llenando porque no, no las había visto. No, yo había buscado, pero no encontraba, pero ya vi como me hacían falta como dos. Oh, ok. Please do it. Please participate okay. in the okay, others okay. and give your opinions and practice with the exercise I posted. Ok. Ok. Thanks. Good evening. Good, David. good evening. Bye. Good night. Bye. Uh, good night. Yes.